Hello, everyone. Welcome to my 90 Gossip 24 channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. Before his next court battle with Angela Deem, 90 Day Fiancé, Happily Ever After, star Michael Ilisami has given some clues regarding his mental health. With the intention of having a happy married life with Angela, he relocated to the United States in December 2023. But three months later, Michael was forced to leave Angela's home because she was verbally abusing him all the time. In Texas, he sought safety and was helped by a new group of Nigerian friends. Even though Michael tried to live a quiet life, Angela asked for their marriage to be dissolved so that he could be sent back to Nigeria. On his Instagram story, Michael just retweeted a message from at Self Care With Wall that made reference to his failed marriage and legal dispute with Angela. According to the caption, because I carry it well doesn't mean it's not heavy. The image included a street sign. Michael used the message to let 90 Day Fianke supporters know that things are harder than they seem, even if he didn't give any specifics about his present circumstances. By posting the quotation, Michael implied that his upbeat and positive social media posts don't accurately represent the challenges he faces in his private life. Little is known about Michael's ongoing legal battle with Angela on his latest Instagram story. The comment does, however, highlight his attempt to deal with the strain and tension in private. In an effort to earn $25,000 to hire a lawyer to represent him in court against his estranged wife, Michael recently appealed to his fans for help. Remarkably, Michael's followers gave him slightly over $50,000 in donations. His detractors, however, took advantage of the occasion to charge him with organizing a fraud with his fundraiser. He was even charged with embezzlement for purchasing a high-end vehicle. He has made the decision to manage the legal issues alone and post sparingly on social media, since he most likely doesn't want bad influences to sabotage his American dream. The last time Michael made reference to his legal proceedings was in September 2024. He hasn't given any updates in weeks, indicating that he wants to keep his difficulties personal. As he becomes more of a social media influencer, it seems that he wants his followers to pay greater attention to his American way of life. He might have gotten legal counsel, and in order to prevent any issues, his lawyer has urged him not to disclose any information about his case online. Even still, it's great to see Michael succeeding in spite of his personal and legal troubles with Angela. In his earlier posts, he talked about working out, playing soccer, tasting new foods, and traveling to new places. It's possible that Michael shares these nice postings to project a positive image and let fans of 90 Day Fianke happily ever after know that they've helped make him happy. After her most recent appearance, 90 Day Fianke star Angela Deem is receiving a lot of attention. After a brief hiatus following the destruction caused by Hurricane Helen in Georgia, she has returned to social media. Angela has also remained quiet about her legal disputes with Michael L. Sammy, and it appears that she is giving herself more attention these days. Previously, after Hurricane Helen, Angela posted updates on TikTok. The 90 Day Fianke star claims that despite the fact that it was hard, she and her family are making it. She continued by saying that despite all of the hurricane's destruction, she is thankful to be alive. The reality TV star also expressed gratitude to the volunteers that traveled from one state to another to assist the victims. After going to a club, it seems that Angela has returned to her good public persona. A video of the well-known rapper comment showing love to Angela was uploaded by a 90 Day FNK fan page. He used rapping to make endearing remarks to the TLC star. Many commenters, however, assert that Common was acting like Drew Barrymore and that he was unaware of Angela's identity. He probably doesn't even know who she is. He is mimicking Drew Barrymore. Wow, I adore him, but I've lost a lot of respect. He wouldn't have done it if he didn't know that woman. He did what he does for fans, 
and she was one of them. I believe she was in pain following the storm. This is hilarious because it's so embarrassing. Michael and Angela have uneasily kept quiet about one another, particularly in relation to their legal disputes. In June 2024, Angela Dean filed for an omen. The 90-day Fian K. Star feels that her ex-husband should be penalized for his alleged marital fraud. However, Angela might be forced to divide all of her assets with Michael if he filed for divorce and claimed spousal support. In recent months, Michael Elisami has also been involved in some scandals. They included his dubious fundraising. In order to pay for his legal bills and employ an attorney, he first requested $25,000. He soon received the money he requested, but he kept his GoFundMe open until it had surpassed $50,000. This led to rumors that Michael was spending money on personal expenses, such as his pricey housing and car rent. After Michael Ilosami left her to join a new family, Angela Dean from 90 Day Fianke, happily ever after, shut off her gorgeous revenge look in a red top and long platinum blonde hair. Michael and Angela were never compatible, even after over seven years of dating. Even though Michael constantly broke Angela's heart, she refused to break up with him despite the fact that he never really loved her. Even after Michael went to the U.S. in December 2023, their marriage remained strained. In order to escape Angela's verbal abuse and suspicious conduct, Michael fled her home in February 2024. Angela just shared brand new images and videos of herself that highlight her incredible metamorphosis. Wearing a red shirt and black jeans, she seemed younger than ever when she appeared with her friends in one picture. Her long golden blonde wavy hair framed her new slim face, and it matched her bright skin and exquisite makeup. The 90 Day Fianke, a happy ending. The alumnus also posted a video of herself at a media event, standing close to a well-known musician. She had a toned body that went well with her overall outfit, and she looked quite fit. She appears to have recovered from her stress and is now able to concentrate on her favorite activities instead of being worried and upset all the time. Due to her devoted but unreliable relationship with Michael, Angela previously battled a number of insecurities and was unable to live freely. Angela's change in appearance implies that she is now happy with her divorce from her untrustworthy Nigerian spouse. She radiates confidence, which suggests that her legal struggle with Michael is going well. Angela's revenge makeover further demonstrates how much better she is now that she and Michael are no longer together. After a long time, she has finally felt true delight, which has greatly increased her optimism. After terminating her unhealthy relationship with Michael, Angela appears to have shed even more weight based on her glow-up metamorphosis. Her figure has become toned, making her appear younger than she has in the past six years. Even though Michael is embroiled in a scandal, Angela is having the time of her life in 2024. Her makeover gives the impression that she is unconcerned about her failed marriage and upcoming legal battle. According to Angela's most recent photos, she is now leading a better lifestyle. After splitting with Michael, she appears to have changed to convince her followers that she is much better. It's also possible that Angela's revenge makeover is an attempt to prove to people who have mocked her appearance that she won't be defeated by her breakup with Michael. Although Angela has always been a strong woman, she lost confidence as a result of her unhappy marriage and Michael's adultery. The 90 Day Fianke, Happily Ever After? Alumnus seemed to have regained her confidence at last. So what do you guys think about this update? Let me know in the comments below. And if you like my videos, please press like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time.